small fleshy bro fleshy <laughs> that's not what i meant to say hopefully when i peel the tape up what up Hello my beautiful babes, what is up? It's Brandy. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here and if you are new, welcome. For today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I create this beautiful, sexy eye makeup today. I am obsessed with it. It's been a hot minute since I've done a neutral look like this. So if you guys are interested in how I create it, then you guys should definitely keep on watching. Before we get started, let me zoom you guys in just a hair. I should probably do my brows first. Hold on one second before I make that horrible mistake of doing my brows after because that would not be good. Now that the brows are done, we can officially move on to the eye makeup. I'm just going to take a little bit of my Magic Star Concealer and put this all over my lid. I like to use concealer as primer. Then taking my JSC Orgy palette, mixing Silk Robe and Gender Fluid together, using them to set my eyes. I want my eyes to be snatched like they've never been snatched before, so to achieve that, I'm gonna be taking some tape. For this step, you could use any black liquid liner. I'm just going to be taking my Tarte Sex Kitten. After spending like 20 minutes on this wing, I think this is as good as it's going to get so we can officially move on to the eyeshadows. I'm just dipping into I'm Close on a flat eyeliner and brow brush and placing this right over black liner, but only taking it to about my pupil. I do have hooded eyes so this part is going to take me a little bit longer because I have to be extra careful where I place these shades. I'm going to use this small flat brush and just blend that shade even more now that it's been placed where I want it to be. Keep in mind that there is absolutely nothing on this brush. It is completely clean. Taking a small bit of invitation only and craving chocolate. Slowly placing that on the edges of that wing. Again, only taking the shade to my pupil. Using a small fluffy brush and dipping into the shade top. Using that to blend out the edges. As the shades are getting lighter, I'm not exactly following that distinct line of the wing like I was doing in the beginning. I really want this to fade and be like a beautiful, sexy, smoky fox eye, which is not really easy to do when you have hooded eyes. Whenever I see a tutorial, it's always with people who don't have hooded eyes and I'm like, <laughs> that must be nice. Can't relate. So... I will say it is possible for us hooded girls, but it takes a little bit more TLC, I will say that. I feel like it's looking 10 times better in person than it is on camera. Hopefully when I peel the tape off, I'll feel a bit better. Using a small fluffy brush, taking a little bit of blowout and the shade bed or floor. <laughs> Placing that on top of the last shade so it really blends beautifully because we want this to be smoky, smoky, smoky. I'm going to quickly hop off camera to do the rest of my makeup, which I am very nervous and excited about because I'm going to be trying cream contour for the very first time. I have no idea how that's going to turn out. But yeah, I will do that very quickly and I'll be right back with you guys to finish the rest of the look. Now, whatever is left on this brush that has the shade I'm close, I'm going to slightly... Bring that shade down to the outer edge of my bottom lash line. Just a smidge like that. Going into Glory Hole and taking two taps onto the brush, I'm putting that on that outer corner just because it's not the exact shade 
that I was hoping for, but this one is whoo, an exact match. Going back into invitation only and craving chocolate. Placing this in the outer half of my lower lash line. Taking the shade top and bed or floor. And using that to blend out this inner corner. And then slowly dragging it under the rest of this lash line. Then for brow highlight, I'm using the JSC Supreme Frost in the shade Frozen Peach. It is the same one that I am wearing on my cheeks. Oh, it's gorgeous. Last but not least, going into the Orgy palette and grabbing the shade Gagging. Placing that in the inner corner. This shade was absolutely perfect. Now I'm going to quickly, again, hop off camera, apply some mascara, false lashes, some lips, and then I'll be right back with the final look. Alright guys, so this is the final look and I love how it came out so much. Honestly, I was a little bit nervous when I just had the eyeshadow on. And I think that's just because I'm not used to doing my eyeshadow first and then the base of my makeup. I do it sometimes, but not all that often. I feel like I just couldn't see the full picture without the base with the eyeshadow but now that i have the full glam done i am obsessed now let me quickly go into the small little details that i finished while i was off camera starting off with these lashes because they are my new favorite of all time they are from kiss they are called the new day-to-day -day lash in the style blessed <sighs> when i tell you i've never seen or tried this thin of a band never ever in my entire life you can't even tell that I have false lashes on because the band is so redunculously thin I didn't want anything too crazy because I felt like when I tried to see what it would look like with the fuller lash it wasn't working out. I You couldn't even see the little cat eye that we have going on and the smokiness. It just got lost within the lash. So I thought a neutral one was the perfect option and whew, let me tell you, it was. I love these lashes so much. Now for lip liner, I use the Dragon Beauty Lip Job Liner in the shade 2.0 CC. For lipstick, I use the JSC Velvet Trap in the shade Naked Body. And then to top that off, I use the JSC B Gloss in the shade Legends Only. But yeah, you guys, that is basically it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, as well as hang the notification bell. As always, all the products that I mentioned today will be linked down below in the description box. I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye, guys.